All right, so our first step is to download and install VS Code. We'll do that by going to our browser and then typing VS Code download. Then we will take the first result over there and then we'll choose the installation for Windows 11, which is then going to start immediately. This will prompt you to save your file locally, so you should choose the folder where you want to do that and then click Save. Once the file is downloaded, simply right click on it and select Run as Administrator. The installation dialog box will open up, so what you need to do is click on I accept the agreement and then click on next, and then again I click on next, next, and then next, and then finally simply click on install, which is going to install VS Code on your local system. Once that is done, simply click on finish and this will then launch the VS Code. Over here in VS Code, we are ready to install our extension. So head over to the menu, click on the extension button, and then search for Kodo. Then click on install. This is going to install Kodo on your system. Then you need to click on this continue with GitHub and then open. This is going to open the authentication of browser. So you need to authorize Codium AI to be able to access your GitHub account. Then open the Visual Studio Code and again click on open. We're going to go back to VS Code for our last time and you can check out the menu. There is now the Kodo gen icon. Click on it and then you can search here for different AI models. I'm going to uh, go for the DeepSeek R1 and then you can also start uh, writing your question. Once you're happy with your prompt, you just need to click on enter and the AI model will start generating their response for you together also with the code that they, you can use in your own coding session. Happy coding!